Not all detectives are hard-boiled sociopaths with excellent observation skills. Some detectives aren't even human, as is the case with Pokemon Detective Pikachu. Pokemon Detective Pikachu is an upcoming fantasy mystery film directed by Rob Letterman, who co-wrote the screenplay with Dan Hernandez, Benji Samet, and Derek Connolly from a story by Hernandez, Samet, and Nicole Perlman. Based on the 2016 video game Detective Pikachu, the film is a Japanese-American joint venture produced by Warner Brothers Pictures, Legendary Pictures, and The Pokemon Company in association with Toho Company LTD. It is the first live-action animated film in the Pokemon franchise and represents a separate continuity from the mainline video games and anime series. We at Movie House were pretty excited too, so here are a bunch of spoiler-free trivia about Pokemon Detective Pikachu. Fact 1. The voiceover for large crowd chants were recorded during the Pokemon World Championships 2018 in Nashville. Fact 2. The realistic style of the Pokemon were based on the artwork by R.J. Palmer. The movie's production designer discovered him while he was looking for realistic Pokemon designs on the internet, and he was so impressed by Palmer's artwork that he gave him a job as the concept artist for the movie. Fact 3. Robin Williams was always Nintendo's choice to play Professor Oak. Fact 4. A petition was made to have Danny DeVito to voice Pikachu. Fact 5. Justice Smith was the first person confirmed to be a part of this movie. Smith's character in Paper Towns sang the Pokemon theme song in a strip mall scene after Smith and his co-star Halston Sage suggested it. Fact 6. It has been said that the huge success of Pokemon Go mobile game was the reason why the franchise was allowed to become a live action movie. Fact 7. A Detective Pikachu 2016 video game was released on the Nintendo eShop for the Nintendo 3DS on February 3rd, 2016. It was only released in Japan until 2018, when a full version of the game for Western audiences came along. Fact 8. In April 2016, The Hollywood Reporter announced a bid for live-action movie rights to Pokemon. The Pokemon Company started a top-secret auction, and the three frontrunners were Legendary Entertainment, Sony Pictures, and Warner Brothers Pictures. On July 20, 2016, The Hollywood Reporter published an article stating that Legendary Entertainment won the auction for the live-action movie rights to Pokemon. Both Legendary Entertainment and The Pokemon Company announced Detective Pikachu as the first film to be fast-tracked to start production in 2017. Fact 9. According to a report from May of 2016, Nintendo could possibly release more feature films based on its video games. Its last movie was Super Mario Bros. in 1993, which the company considered a flop. Fact 10. One of three video game feature films of 2019, the others being Columbia Pictures and Sony Animation's The Angry Birds Movie 2 and Paramount Animation's Sonic the Hedgehog. Fact 11. This is the second time a legendary entertainment film has moved from Universal to Warner. The other film was Kong Skull Island. Fact 12. The second trailer came out one day before the reveal trailers of Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield. The start of the 8th generation of Pokemon for the Nintendo Switch, the first main series Pokemon games playable on TV screens, released later on in 2019. Fact 13. This is the first Pokemon film to be rated PG by the MPAA. Fact 14. At the time of production, there were over 800 Pokemon. It is reported that Detective Pikachu will only feature a little over 60 Pokemon. Fact 15. This is Ryan Reynolds and Karen Sony's first collaboration outside of the Deadpool series. Fact 16. Ryan Reynolds' fourth time voice acting in a theatrical film after The Croods, Turbo, and The Voices. Fact 17. The first trailer for the movie was viewed 100 million times in the first 24 hours on all the social media platforms. Hope you've enjoyed our compilation. Do let us know your thoughts in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe for more, and thanks a lot for watching.